Okay guys, I've gotten a virtual machine of Windows Vista and I'm going to call a tech support scammer. So I'm going to boot this up and I'm going to go to text now or Reddit because Reddit lets me get all the numbers here. And I'm going to let Windows boot up here. And I'm going to find a number. Alright, I'm gonna find I'm gonna find a number. I can't go any higher resolution than that, but it's okay. Get word Windows Vista here. So I'm gonna find a scam number. Trying to find one. This one might work. They might need access to my PC. They might not. I don't know. Just in case they do, I have a Windows Vista virtual machine. Hi, uh, I've, I'm having some issues with Mc, McAfee on my computer. I, it accidentally got uninstalled on my computer and I cannot install it again. Can you help me with that? <coughs> so uh, McAfee got uninstalled on my computer and I did not do it and I don't know how to get it back. Um, I don't know how it got uninstalled. Yeah, I'm in front of my computer. I'm using an old version of Windows. Old version of Windows. So what kind of browser do you use on it? Uh, like Google Chrome, something, Firefox? It's, I think it's Firefox. Open up the Firefox. Okay. Once it is open now, uh, do I think close it? Go oh. to your regular home screen. Okay, I'm on my desktop. Okay. Now, tell me, can you see your keyboard, your keypad? Yeah, 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 my, my, my keyboard. The left hand bottom corner of your keyboard, do you see the CTRL, control key? Yes, I see the control key. Right next to it, which key do you see? Um, there's the, like, I see a Windows key. Like a Give a push on the Windows, give a push on the Windows key and hold it down. Don't leave it. And with the help of another finger, push on the letter R and then Romeo. Okay. Two keys at, two keys at the same time. Window with the letter R and then Romeo. And then tell me, do you see a pop-up on your screen? Yes, I do. I see, uh, something, it says run. Uh, it's, it's blank. <coughs> oh, the pop-up? Yeah, 
It just says type the name of a program, folder, document, or internet resource and Windows will open it for you. It says, it's a little box where you can type, it says open, and then it says OK, cancel, browse. And the digital box, is it empty or something is written inside it? Uh, it's empty. You can push on that empty box, type over there, www dot. Okay. Then the letter D as in alpha. Okay. M as in alpha. Okay. Y as in yellow. Alright. D as in David. Okay. E as in echo. Alright. S as in Sam. Okay. G as in King. Okay. Dot com. Okay, dot com, C O M. Now spell out to me the whole thing, what have you written down? It's www dot anydesk.com Now read out to me what do you see on your screen? What have you written down so far? Uh, well I'm, I'm on their website. It's like, it says anydesk then like download. So should I download it? Uh, what does it say on the website? Read out to me. The website says access any device at any time from anywhere, always secure and fast. Download now, order now. Push on download now. Okay. Okay, the f Okay, the file is downloaded now. Should I run it? Yes. Okay. It says cancel or allow. Should I press allow? Allow. Okay. I can't believe this, guys. I got a scammer on the phone. He's gonna connect to this fake PC. It's gonna be so. Funny. Hopefully, he does not notice the virtual box thing down here. What do I even do about that? Whatever. We'll see what he does. Okay. Okay. So now I'm in the program now. What it say? It says your address, and then it says a few, uh, uh like some numbers there. The numbers? Okay. Okay, so they are 309. Okay, and then after that, it's 498. And then lastly, it's 954. Gonna have remote access to this virtual machine. Now, I got it. Yeah, that. Yeah, that, that's it. Next to this nine numbers, do you see this the black color lock icon? Yeah, I see that. You will push on that lock icon. Okay. It says set password. It says set okay. password. Now you need to put the company password on it. It will be help one two three four five. All in your team and all linked together. There are no spaces between them. Okay. Help one two three four five. Okay, I did that. Now put the same thing in the confirm password as well. Yep, okay, I did that. Okay, I did. Now after you do that on your screen, after pushing on apply, in the top do you see it says interactive access? Uh, no I don't see that. Uh, what do you see in the top? It says... In the middle. In oh, the, in the middle? Middle of the screen. It says top. permissions. And then I see it. Oh, in intera interactive access. Okay, I see that. Right below that, you will see three options. You need to push on the third one that says next 
Okay, I press that. It says, firewall has block some of these features. Keep blocking or unblock. Okay. And what else does it say? Uh, okay, I said unblock and continue. It says a profile is already using this password. Okay. Uh, you push on cancel. Okay. Now, right about set password, you see it says default. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Push on default. Okay. What do I click on next? Third option, full access. Okay. Okay. Oh, are you on my computer right now? Yeah. Okay. Sorry, are you talking about any desk? Yeah. Uh I, I I'm in settings right now. Should, oh yeah, new session, new session. Okay, now I'm on any desk version 7 and I have a support code here. The support code is 309-498-1000. Okay. Oh, okay, so I should X out of it. It's a personal computer. How old is this computer? About uh, 10 years old. Do you use it for what purpose? Like for using emails? Uh, I do. So I do, uh, like, I watch a lot of YouTube videos. I do online banking. I do um, file management, stuff like that. Uh, just today. I was watching YouTube videos. Yeah. Sure, maybe a month ago. Uh, I'm on auto pay. I forgot, sir. Uh, 
a few hundred, I think a f around a hundred bucks or so. No, 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 McAfee is the only virus software I have. No, I, I, I don't have that at all. someone to fix it for me online. Do I have to pay yet, or can I pay later? Sorry? Can I pay later, or, or what? Well, as, as per the company policies, you need to pay before you are like getting your service. Like, uh, before we provide you the service of installing the services back to your computer, you need to pay that amount. Why would I have to pay now? That would be, that's so weird. Okay, okay. So let me just so let me just uh, think about it and see if I need to make the transaction now, okay? Okay. So where are you located by the way? I'm in San Jose, California. Okay, so are you sure you're in San Jose? Uh, what time is it in San Jose? Sorry. What time is it in San Jose? Stop looking it up. You're looking it up. Stop searching. Stop searching on Google. Sir, are you sure that, Are you sure the time is not 4:41 a.m.? Because you're lying about where you are. You're not in. You're not in San Jose. You're in New Delhi. Come on. It's in India. You're in India right now. And how would I talk to you? Because you're using a you're using a VOIP software and a VPN to talk to me. You're you're basically a criminal. And what would I get by talking to you? Well sir, you're just a scammer. You should stop doing that. You should get a better job. Well, I already know. Reddit told me. Reddit. Reddit.com. Reddit.com. Well, I, I, I'm not saying their name. I'm not saying their name. 
but I know it's like 4.43 a.m. Where you are. Okay, okay. Mother Chorbo Sarike. That's Hindi, that's your own language, sir. That is your language. Thank you for letting me know that. He completely hung up, guys. Sorry you can't see me right now. Yeah, guys, he got scared. He hung up. So yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed that video of me scamming a scammer. I'm gonna make my webcam a bit bigger. Hope you guys enjoyed the video of me scamming a scammer. And yeah. <sighs> Alright, I guess I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.